Welcome, Welcome back, back to the channel, channel. And, and today we have some very important news to tell you. On Saturday, a new Jill? baby goat, a new baby goat was surprisingly born. We didn't even know she was pregnant. We kind of thought, and we thought well, she was way off, like mm -hmm. three months off. And then surprisingly, we let them out in the fields, and then we go to feed. We're like, the wow, other herd. her udder's getting big. She yeah, she should be doing about a month. Yeah, and we thought like, we, we were a couple we months off. We thought, and so we went to go feed the other herd. And we come back to feed uh, the herd, which that Jill was in, and there's just a baby on the ground. It was so. It was oh my, like, it is so it, clean. It is so it was so clean. clean. It was so clean and adorable, and it's beautiful. I just gotta show you. Uh -huh. So let's show you our adorable new baby goat. This is Pongo, the little goat slash lamb slash <laughs> Dalmatian. We're just kidding. He's isn't he adorable though. He's just a little goat, and he adorable. He's really sweet. He doesn't even look like a Dalmatian though. I love lamb that about him. One. He looks like a lamb too. Cause of his ears. Cause he has his his dad's look at ears. Look the little spots. And he's so fluffy. Look at that. I'm not kidding. He is so fluffy compared to his sister. He's really plump because he's the only baby. Yeah. He's the only true baby we have right now because. Cause um, he's like not even a week old. Yeah, he's not even a week old yet. Like a couple of days. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Three days. Three days. Yeah. Oh wow. Huh. Wow. That's pretty cool. Mm -hmm. He's so small still. But there's this amazing spot in between his ears. See that little black dot? He's got an adorable little black speckle it's only under on the his inside ears. of his ear. Yeah. Inside. <laughs> I love it. But Can I hold it? Inside. Yeah. You should go get Clarabelle to show them how cute. I know, like Clarabelle's is. difference between him is like, wow, Clarabelle's so huge. I know. <laughs> Look at him. Go He's got a, okay. He's got gorgeous blue eyes. Look at those eyes. Now that is a cute baby, in my opinion. Look at those cute little blue eyes. And we also have, I think Hershey has blue eyes? Maybe. I just love this baby so much. We named him Pongo after the dad uh, Dalmatian in 101 movie. And I just thought it looked so cute for him. Our mom came out with it. And so that's his name. We also have, um, Candy, Hershey, Eleanor, and Del we, we, we don't have Delilah anymore, sadly. But we also have um, Arthur, which he's now old enough to be a cat. So we're going to keep, we're going, that's the only buck we're keeping from last year's uh, kidding. And he's the only one we have left, and Clarabelle. So this is, he, he's our second generation we've had out of jail. And this is the first. So he's so chunky. And they have the same they have the same mom and dad. But they were born at different times. They were born, yeah, like I was saying, second that was this is the second generation made. <laughs> Claire was so huge compared to him. I know. Look at her horns though. Look they look little she's needles. Yeah. Really he's needles. not growing any right now. <laughs> he well, he's kinda acting like a sister, not barely growing any. And we like the horns on our goats because it's hot here and it's hot in Florida and and it, it'll hear, help him cool off a lot better. Yeah. If you hear that, that's the mama Jill of yeah. both of these babies. And she's sad that we took both of them away. Well, she actually, like, Clarabelle, mm -hmm. she doesn't really care about her now that she has a brand new baby. She's like, baby. Yeah. <laughs> it's because she's, uh, she already weaned Clarabelle off, and Clarabelle's already old enough to be her own mama, so. Like, we can have her bread with Arthur. I told him, I think I, told, I was telling him about that. Oh, yeah. okay. No, I didn't. Well, okay. she's enough an age where she can breathe. Yes. And she's, she's big enough. She's almost the biggest size as a dwarf. She's as big as uh, uh, her mom. Almost as big as her mom. Yeah. But look really at the heavy. size difference in that. That is so small. Look, I can hold her like this. And Bella can still hold her. I'm going off the camera. <laughs> she's so heavy. I'm not kidding. She's super, She super may heavy. be like a weak breath. And what I was talking about is that it was strange how this baby has floppy ears like his daddy, but this one has the mama ears like your mama and I love it. Newbie and dwarfs is what these are. And we're gonna have another surprise video coming up soon. <gasps> Sebastian! Okay, so he's our new barn cat. This is Sebastian if you can see him. He's my kitty. Yeah. We brought him here to the barn and he's now our barn cat. He's kind of hard to see right now but he's looking on the fence. Yeah. We brought him here um about two weeks ago you'd say? Yeah. About, about two weeks ago because we need someone to help our barn, help out our barn, and make sure no one critters mouse. get in the one that we don't want. Not these cute critters. And he loves them. You should see Arthur and Sebastian play. We have to get some cute clips of them. 
I'm not kidding. They love They're each like other. best friends. They're like best friends. Arthur hates dogs and Sebastian loves dogs, so that's a problem. And Sebastian's our cat. The Barton cat. So Arthur loves cats though. Yeah, know, yeah, yeah, yeah. Arthur loves that. cats. Uh, yeah, I said Arthur loves, uh, well, Sebastian loves dogs, and even though he's a cat. <laughs> so thank you guys for watching. If you would help us out in subscribing, that would be amazing, because only 20% of our viewers are subscribed. Thank you guys. Bye.